Today, you guys, we're going to have a fun video. Let's open up my new Rainbow High doll and see what came with her. Welcome back to our channel and today I thought we would take a close look at what exactly comes inside this Skylar Bradshaw Rainbow High Winter Wonderland limited edition doll and I thought we would also take a little look at some of the other stuff that I got for my birthday. Um, kind of like a little bit more of an up close. Let me try to get my camera to focus y'all. Okay, I can only hope it's not blurry. Um, it doesn't look blurry to me, so I hope it's not blurry to you guys. But anyway, um, I thought we would take a little bit of a closer look at what exactly I got so far for my birthday. Um, I'm actually filming this on Saturday. You guys will see it on Sunday. And so I'm going to Sarah's tonight. And so I probably have more things, but this is just what I got um, Friday for my birthday. So... We will take a closer look at anything else I get as I get it in. Anyway, this is Nanny Crocheted This, and I wanted to show it up close. It's a Pickles Awake. She knows that I'm wanting a Pickles Awake. <laughs> and so, <laughs> she crocheted me a pickle. It's a pickle that's awake. And it's got a diaper. See the little diaper pins? It's got a little diaper. It's a little girl baby. And she even crocheted her a little blanket. And so that is adorable. That is actually going up in the filming area. And, um, yeah. She doesn't have a name. You guys, I'm sorry. She doesn't have a name, but she's my little pickle awake. <laughs> and then the other thing that I got in is this, um... LOL. Okay, let me let me fix this stuff real quick. Is the little LOL. And so with the little LOL doll um, that came, it came with this little case. This little case here that's got the little hangers that came with it that you can pretend like you hang her clothes up. It did come with crayons because she is a um, LOL color. Uh, crayon doll, so I'm going to do it like this so you guys can see better. Um, and the little, also came with the little shoes, was in a mystery bag. The, her little um, strawberry latte was part of a mystery bag. Her little glasses that she has on is part of the mystery bag. And here's what she, her little eyes look like. Let's put her little glasses up. There you go. And there's what she looks like without the little glasses on. And her little Crayola purse was a mystery bag. And the crayons and the hangers and everything. And so just adorable. She also set her down. Oops. Set her up in here. Now, sorry, if you guys are mumbling behind me, it's Nanny. She's reading. She, said, she got quiet now. <laughs> so... She is actually doing her Bible study, you guys. So that's what Nanny's doing. Anyway, let me just set that like that. We're not going to focus a whole bunch of time on the little LOL. But anyway, um, her little latte that she was drinking on. How cute is that? You do it like that so you guys can maybe see. And then she also came with... This is all the different ones that you can get in this particular um, brand. And so the one that I got is Rad Red Cutie. And that's the one I got. But there's actually several you can get. It's actually really cute, you know, if you wanted to start collecting them. There's a whole bunch of different colors you could get. And so she's actually my first um, ever. Well, she's on the stand really good, you guys. Anyway, she is my first ever LOL doll. So, so super cute. Love her. Um, from Pudgy Papa and my daughter-in-law. And it also came with, let me set her back up in here. She's also going to be set up in the filming area with my little silicone babies. Because if you think about it, she's like silicone. 
Yes, they are. And then she also came with um, this. And I think these are her clothes. Because you can see you got like a little neck piece, some buttons, some arms. That, I believe, is her skirt. And it came with quite a few of them. So, um, you can, you know, accessorize her. And that's what the crayons essentially are for. And then you can stand her up here. And she can turn around and fashion show, fashion show. <laughs> but we are not fashion showing it today with her. No, we're not. We are going to play something else. Oh, and it also came with, that shows all the different LOLs that you can get. There she is. Is this she, is that mine? Yeah. I believe that one's mine. So, there she is. So, super cute. So, let me set her to the side. And then, I was also going to show um, Nanny's birthday card that she made me just a little bit closer. Party till the cows come home. Party till the cows come home. Anyway, that was that. So now we are down to... Oh, and this also came with a little LOL of you can hang your little outfits on the hangers. Ain't that cute that you make? And just kind of tell... I already fit... Me and my granddaughter figured out how to put it together. So we did not need those instructions. So now we are coming to... The Rainbow High Doll. Oh, yes. All right, you guys. And I am prepared. So we've got the snowman accessorizing kit. Got different faces and stuff like that. And then we have instructions because, yes, she comes with instructions. Okay, so let's go ahead and let me slide. Here is her box. And there's a glare, so I'm, I really apologize for that. I don't know how to fix that glare. Anyway, here is what the box itself looks like. And she says, Puff, it's complete. And you mold and make your own snowman. And her name is Skylar Bradshaw. And here is the other Winter Wonderland dolls you can get. So pretty. Yes, here's mine. Isn't she pretty? Yes, she is. Okay, anyway, I love the box. Love the box. But, you know, once you take the doll out of the box, what exactly do you do with the box? Nothing. <laughs> but... It's a pretty box, and I am thinking since I started this glue booking and journaling and stuff like that, how hard would it be to actually cut, like, you know, like, say, this part of the box, maybe, you know, certain parts off of the box to use in a glue book or a journal. So that is something that is very possible to happen. All right, you guys, I am going to completely, because as you know, yes, it's, well, actually, I have opened Rainbow High Dolls that has these things so bad around it that drove me nuts. But in the meantime, let me go ahead and get everything um, out, and then we'll lay it down, and then we'll um, see about making a snowman. Yes. All right, you guys, she is free freedom and so she comes with this stand that you can see. Hey, I can never make these work I am not gonna lie out of all my rainbow high and shadow high dolls there isn't any of them that I can make work on these stands but in any case there's the stand of course you get a comb which that's something else I don't really do is I don't really comb their hair due to the fact that their hair is always specially styled and she's got her cool um, winter skiing glasses. I'm trying to do that so you guys can maybe see them. She has got her hot cocoa. Yes, her hot cocoa. And she has got her purse, which I am going to do this so I don't lose that hot cocoa. <laughs> anyway, and she's got this cute little purse. Then over on this side, we have got our mold to make our snowman. We have got our sand that makes the snowman. And we have got our syringe to um, make the slime for her. And then we've got the star. Yes, she is so pretty, you guys. Okay, so I'm doing it like this so maybe you guys could see that she's shiny and glittery all over her skin. 
she's iridescent her hair has got pretty blue sparkles in it which I put her down okay and she's got this rockin um, winter style so pretty and her hair is actually soft like my other rainbow high and shadow high dolls you guys um, their hair's not that soft um, it really isn't it's like feels like the hair it feels like this up here this almost feels like glue like it is glued into place the little toppy thing but my other dolls their whole hair feels like that that's why I don't mess with their hair but this actually feels soft like I can run my fingers through it and she has got these pretty blue eyes there is a shadow being cast she's got these pretty blue eyes so pretty um this little jacket with a little zipper little shirt underneath and i thought she was a mermaid when i saw her in the box but you know you guys tell me you wouldn't have thought that too but no she's not she's just a winter wonderland but in her skirt if you guys notice we have different colored stuff and that different color stuff is how we're going to um change her dress and so that's part of her novelty. So let's go ahead and do the slime first. Um, Nanny, can you toss me that bottle of distilled water? Thank you. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so I have got distilled water here. Um, and I keep a bottle of distilled water um, for doing my um, painting whenever I, whenever I do paint. On reborn dolls which isn't often you guys know that okay and so what the instructions say? I'm looking for the instructions right now okay so we have instructions so we're going to go ahead and do this first um, okay so this is just showing what all came with her okay here we go so the first thing you got to do is one is lay the doll down on a flat surface and massage or shake the powder in each panel to ensure it's evenly di distributed. Okay. All right. So I'm back. I also got a phone call, so I just went ahead and paused it. But anywho, what I was, well, my goodness. Okay. She's got such pretty long eyelashes. Anyway, I distributed the stuff, I guess, as best as I can. And so, well, it's showing what not to do. Well, I don't know how to do it. I distributed as best I can. I did what it shows. Then I've got the distilled water, and then it's showing to put the water in the syringe. So let's do that. All right, y'all. I got a glass. So it will be easier. Okay, so let me get. So you get 30. Of water. And it's supposed to be room temperature water. And distilled. So let's see what happens. And then you're supposed to put it on the valve. And then. Start putting. the water okay this isn't so easy you guys am I even doing this right okay let's try it now okay now it's going okay so Okay. I don't know if you guys can see it, but
All right, so we are done with the sliming process. And I am not going to lie to you guys. I don't understand the point of this. Maybe it's supposed to look frosty or something. And um, I don't know. I know I used distilled water like it said. I made sure it was room temperature. And well, I mean, I guess it looks colored, you know. But yeah, to me, that, that wasn't that I don't know it just got things wet and it just wasn't that fun so I don't know that I think more is a novelty and maybe a littler kid but like I don't know I guess her dress does look pretty now I, I'm not I don't know anyway let's do our snowman so I probably could have got away with not doing that and would have been okay with that all right so let me move the little syringe out of the way and now for the snowman let me get the instructions for the snowman. So supposedly with the snowman, you just peel off the seal on the back of the snowflake, pop out the snowflake insert, cover the sand side, carefully flip the container over onto your hand, open the packet of powder. Okay, where is this? Open the packet of powder. Hold the sand in the palm of one hand, then use the other hand to pour the powder into the center of the sand. Add the powder a little at a time. Fold the sand in half. Continue folding and pulling until the powder is thoroughly blended into the sand. Gently push the sand into the mold. Create the flat surface. Da -da -da -da. Open the mold to reveal your snowman. Stands on its own. Okay. So basically... You open this.
right. Look at our little snowman. He turned out super, super cute. So I'm just pressing the little extra um, around so that it's all. And let me put this in the trash bag that I have over here. Well, even my awake pickles is, is glittery now. Yes, she is. She is glittery now. All right. Everything is glittery. Glitter, 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 glitter. Thank goodness we love glitter. All right. So, what face do we want to put on her? I want to put her in a happy little face. So, I'm going to. I guess you just stick it in is how you do it and then you stick it in I guess this is how you do it you guys how would you stick this into this Well, I don't, I don't know. We're just not going to be able to, um, we're just going to have a nice little snowman setting up here. Let me reshape him because those things don't want to stick on you guys. I don't know why, but they do not. Um, I'm not sure, but we're just going to go ahead and make a little magical snowman there and here him can sit on a snowflake. And that is the way he will be set up with her. And then now we have her. So let's go ahead, put her little glasses on. She's even more glittery than she was. And then let's go ahead and do her little purse. And she's got her little pet snowman. And there we go. What do you guys think? Isn't she pretty? Let's see. If I can put her on the stand. Okay. Let's see if we put her on the stand. There she is. And let's put her little. Okay. So she's kind of leaning a little forward on the stand, but that's okay. Let's give her her little purse. It's got her little cup in it. And okay, give her her little purse. Let me come back down where you guys could see her better. And her little comb to comb her little locks. And her little a snowman that, you know, we did the best we could, didn't we, you guys? There you go. Can you see it now? Okay, there you go. Anyway. I think that is going to do us. We are covered in glitter, glitter, glitter. So I think that's going to do it for us today, you guys. If you like this video, then go on down there and give us a big, see all the glitter, thumbs up. And while you're down there, watch, go ahead and subscribe. It's free. It doesn't cost anything. And well, me and all of my cloud kids, we really love you guys. So until the next video, everybody. Bye. Rebecca.